Ladies and gentlemen, Joel McCow, how are we feeling? Expect to see a pit popping off down here. How we doing down here on the floor? We good? How we doing on this side? We good? We got some folks up top. You guys have fun out there this evening. That was pretty good. I don't think they quite heard. It. I said, "Are y'all having fun out there this evening?" Y'all, yeah, this is a tremendous honor for us to be here, man. Thank you to Shaquille O'Neal. I don't know where he is. We haven't gotten to meet him yet. We are huge, huge fans. And it is a tremendous honor to be here tonight supporting the cause. Thank y'all for showing up, for singing along, for dancing, doing the thing. Make some noise for Jennifer Hudson one time. Come on. <laughs> Before we later this evening, we got John Legend with Lina. What an honor, man. Listen, I know we should probably uh, keep singing and keep the night going, but I, I told myself that if I ever had the chance to tell this story, that I would tell it. And here, in the presence of Shaq, I hope he's listening somewhere. But I have to tell this story. This was a few years ago. I was staying at the Sunset Marquee, and I walked in the building, and they said, Mr. Mooney, we have your dry cleaning. And I said, okay, awesome. I'm forgetting things all the time. Makes sense. I get into the room, and I find this bag, and I open it up, and I see what I think is a black shirt that I left. And I open it up, and what I find is a pair of boxers that me, Dan, and several of our friends could have fit inside of. <laughs> and then I look at the closet, and there's a bunch of clothes hanging up. And I realize that my name, Shay, is just one letter away from being another gentleman's name who was about 17 times my size. And so I did what, what any man would do, and I took a bunch of photos, and I, I sent them to my, around to my friends. And I think, you possibly, I did FaceTime Dan. I think we might have a picture of it up here somewhere, but if we don't, I'm going to carry on. And here it is. 
Thank you guys so much for coming for Dan and Shay. This is where we live, I think. Yeah. Well, there's no picture, but you can just imagine my entire body being clothed in a t-shirt that looks like a woman's dress, and it was beautiful. It was stunning, and I'm pretty sure it was Shaquille O'Neal's. I have yet to confirm the story, but we're gonna confirm the story later on. <laughs> you could say I was pretty blown away. You could even say that, uh, that I was speechless. Introduce myself to Mr. Shaquille O'Neal. And this is crazy, guys, because I'm 6'2", and he makes me look maybe 5'6". Oh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> you guys good? I don't know how you guys got these seats, but this is a, this is a pretty great location. How are you? How are you, man? Oh, we got to get a picture. Yes, we should. Y'all just talk amongst yourselves. Joe, where's Joe at? Joe, you need to come back and tell some jokes. This is crazy again, guys. I am 6'2".
You guys just, we're doing stuff over here, okay? But guys, seriously, thank you all so much for uh, making us feel so welcome. And the next song that we're going to do, we had to throw this one in there. This is, uh, we're going off script right here, but uh, we're going to play one of our favorite songs that we have uh, ever been a part of. And I feel like an event like this, first of all, it's an honor to be a part of some, something so incredible, something that is bigger than ourselves. That's why music, that's why entertainment is so incredible. We get to give back and be a part of something so much bigger than ourselves. And that's exactly what tonight is all about. It's for these incredible kids and for Shaq, man, for putting this on. This is just an incredible thing to be a part of. And this next song is, uh, you know, we've, we've dealt with a lot of this. I know everybody deals with comparison. And, you know, comparison is a thief of all joy. And once you start chasing after the wrong things, you can kind of go down that path. And we realize very, very quickly that it doesn't matter, you know, what kind of house you live in. It doesn't matter if the grass looks green on the other side. It's all about family. And it's not just the family that you're born into, but it's the family that you get to choose. And tonight, here in Las Vegas, I sure as hell feel like a family with you guys. This is amazing, being a part of something that is so much bigger than ourselves. So thank you for making us feel welcome. And let the message of this song sink in. If you guys know it, y'all sing along. This is called Bigger Houses. Y'all aren't local, right? Y'all in for out of town? 
Scottsdale, Arizona. I like it. That's a beautiful place. We're going to come visit y'all. The weather's getting nasty in Nashville. You're from Chicago down here? We like Chi-Town. <laughs>